Last car takes the oval. Hello again, friends. Keanu Bitterzicki, glad to be here with you as Last Car makes its first move onto the oval. We had our qualifications earlier, in which another pole position for Rainforest. You can see that qualification uh, finishing standings up there. Penguin, who's finished last in each of our first two races, takes second. Maybe that's a sign of things to come on an oval for Penguin after finishing last on those two road courses. Canarium third, Pacifica fourth, Black Shadow is fifth. Rattlesnake, who is the points leader and our defending winner from our second race, will start sixth. Nitro is seventh after winning the first race. As you see, there are the championship standings. 75 points, four points the lead uh, for Rattlesnake between Nitro and Rattlesnake. And then Ivory third. Ivory, though, will start last in this field. Rainforest and Volcano round out the top five all the way down to Penguin. One note on Penguin was not initially given the 25 points for finishing last after being uh, not being able to finish that last race. That's not the case anymore. They are off though, and we are ready to go. As they cut out to the lead here, turns one and two, it is Canarium up the propelling system around three and four and into the lead for the first lap. It is Canarium leading the pole sitter Rainforest and Penguin, Nitro and Pacifica all the way back. Ivory is made up one spot right now, Volcano running last. As we quickly make our way into lap three of 32. Canarium is in the lead right now by two tenths of a second. Rainforest running second after passing Penguin, but now Nitro has made that pass for second place. Pretty tight here in that middle of the pack. All the way back again, Volcano. All the way down in last. Three tenths of a second now. Made up another tenth has Canarium. And so far, Canarium has run the fastest lap at 8.251. Nitro moves, or remains in second. Rattlesnake, the points leader, moves into third. Ivory starting to work their way up. And there is an accident. Rainforest. The pole sitter in trouble. Meanwhile, Rattlesnake has taken the lead. Let's look at the replay and see what happened. Oh, up and over. And you saw Ivory made some contact with that high uh, plexiglass. Ivory able to stay on the track, not the case for Rainforest. Again, they make contact. That's something you got to keep an eye on in turns three. Heading into four right after you make contact with that propelling system. And a disaster for Rainforest. Moves into 12th. Will not finish this race. Rattlesnake is the leader. Dragon's Tail has moved into second. Dropping back a little bit is Nitro. Back to fifth now. Canarium led the early portion of this race. And Rattlesnake, the leader, has now just run the fastest lap in lap number 11 of 32. Ivory working their way up to 6th. Canarium back up to 2nd. You've got the two yellow marbles and they make contact and Canarium takes the lead. Up and over they go into turn 3 and 4. And now here comes Black Shadow. Black Shadow takes the lead. May have led the lap. Very tight here. Nitro takes over 3rd from Rattlesnake. The top 4 are all right there. Here comes Ivory into 5th. As they get really tight. Only a little more than a tenth of a second separating Black Shadow, who's in the lead. Canarium runs second. Here is Ivory all the way up to second. Ivory going to go for the lead. Arounds turn two. Here they come up into the propelling system. Arounds turn three and four. It is still Black Shadow. And now Canarium has taken over second, and Ivory makes that pass back. All the way back to Volcano in tenth, and Dragon's Tail, who was in second for a little bit, now running in eleventh. Ivory has dropped back to eighth again. Now all the way to 11th. Ivory's now the last car, on, or the last, excuse me, marble on the course. Black Shadow maintaining the lead. Penguin trying to make their way back up to the front. Right now that lead is two tenths of a second. This is the fastest course that we have seen so far in Glass Car. Penguin, who started second, is back in second. Canarium, Nitro, and Pacifica, the top five. Rattlesnake has moved all the way back to last on the course. That's 11th. After leading for a little bit, Black Shadow still holding the lead. Here comes Penguin. They're coming close. A little contact. Canarium gets into the back of Penguin. May have propelled Penguin, who has finished last in each of the first two races, making a little contact, dropping back to third and now fourth as Black Shadow continues to fend off our other competitors. The lead is less than a tenth of a second. They make contact there on the back. Up and over again into turn three. In this oval... That is very similar to a uh, an Indianapolis Motor Speedway style, and it has provided a lot of contact. Black Shadow still the leader, and now Canarium makes the pass on Nitro for third. Ivory drops back to fifth after taking over fourth. 
Black Shadow still the leader. And that's not the case anymore. Nitro takes the lead. And now it's Dragon's Tail out of nowhere, followed by Pacifica. Rattlesnake's in third. An entire switch up of the field. And Dragon's Tail, with a time of just over eight seconds, just ran the fastest lap of this race. Penguin, who was in second, has dropped all the way to 11th. Rattlesnake, who was running last for a bit, is up in third. Dragon's Tail is the leader. Ivory in second after starting last. And again, more switches. Pacifica now in second. Here comes Nitro. Canarium has been up toward the top this entire time. This is tight. Everybody hanging in there. It is Pacifica now taking the lead for the first time. Only two more to go. They come around turn four. Pacifica will take the white flag. And here we go, side by side, Dragon's Tail into the lead, up into turns three and four. Let's see what happens at the line. It will be Angel out of nowhere. Black Shadow takes second. It was Pacifica and Dragon's Tail that went to the white flag in the lead. They will finish fifth and sixth. And Angel with a redemption story after taking the pole and finishing 10th in our last race, they gain eight spots winning it by only 12 thousandths of a second unbelievably close black shadow second volcano penguin dragon's tail the top five middle of the pack is pacifica and then nitro in seventh and on back from there as you see the updated standings it is a two-point lead now for rattlesnake who loses two points Fastest lap of this race belonged to Dragon's Tail, who runs 11th in the standings, only one point ahead of Penguin. But as far as that goes, for the standings, it is Rattlesnake with 103 points, 101 back to Nitro, and 100 points for Volcano. And then Angel and Ivory are the top five. Despite two poles in three races, Rainforest middle of the pack in sixth. Let's look at some of these replays. This was an incredibly tight race the entire way through. Honestly, going in, I expected there may be some lapped marbles. That was not the case. Just Rainforest, who we will see later on, unable to finish this course. And there you go again. Watch that. Rainforest came out of turn one in third or fourth. It was Canarium who started third that came out in the lead. So again, it's been a uh, not necessarily a good thing to start on the pole. Fast forward to lap six here. And now lap seven, that is where disaster struck off the course. Severe damage for Rainforest, who will finish last, and that really hurts their chances. Rattlesnake and Dragon's Tail were up for a bit. There was a ton of uh, shuffling in this pack. Whether that was Rattlesnake in the lead, Canarium was up at the top for the most part. You had Ivory going from first to last and back again, as there was a ton of passing on this course. Uh, a very impressive, very exciting race, I would say. Black Shadow had the lead for a while. You can see it there. And then things got real wild in a hurry towards the end of this race. Here it is, the final turn. Dragon's Tail went in with the lead, then it was Black Shadow, and out of nowhere, Angel comes across the line by less than a hundredth of a second. Let's have another look at the photo finish. Incredibly tight. There it is. Perfect camera work to show you 12 thousandths of a second. One more time. There it is. Clear as day, although extremely close. Angel is the winner. And all the way back to Rock Slide who finishes last on the course. So, third place to Volcano, finishing uh, two tenths of a second behind. Again, 12 thousandths of a second for Black Shadow. Angel, though, is the one that they all aspire to be. As Angel takes the win, becomes our third different winner in three races of the inaugural season of Glass Car. A uh, very exciting, very close, very entertaining race, I would say. So congratulations to Angel making their way uh, into the list of Glass Car winners for the first time. Glass Car takes the Moonscape Circuit as you have a look at our aerial view here. The race four of the first season of Glass Car 2020. Logan, friends, Keanu Peterson, glad to be here with you as you have a look at our qualifying results. If you didn't have a chance to have a look at that video, there they are on the top left corner of your screen. Canarium won the pole. 
First poll for that marble starting first. That has not been a uh, good sign, though, for these marbles. You don't necessarily want to start first, but it'll be Canarium. Rock Slide, Rainforest, Pacifica, and Penguin were the top five. Our last winner, Angel, will start 10th. There a look at the championship standings. Rattlesnake leading Nitro by two points. And one more point back to Volcano. Angel is fourth. Ivory is fifth. Wins for Rattlesnake, Nitro, and of course Angel in the 12 thousandths of a second win last week at the Oval as you look at the infield. And the setup for our Marvels getting ready for what should be another great race. They are at the Moonscape Circuit. First time we've been here and a very different look as you'll uh, see in the very beginning of this first race. That self-propelling system takes a totally different look. 19 laps in this one, and we are underway. Narium will take them into the lead, and immediately it is Rainforest who will take over that lead again. Hard time for these pole sitters. Wow, look at that. Everybody making contact there, and a lot of contact between the marbles. What I was saying though is the pole sitters have had a really hard time even keeping the lead through the first turn. It's Rainforest who started third in the lead. Right on their tail is Black Shadow. Penguin, Pacifica, and Rattlesnake. Canarium through the first lap has dropped all the way from pole position to seventh. Volcano, third in the point standings, but struggling. Last place right now. The lead is currently seven-tenths of a second. Rainforest to Pacifica, who has taken over second. It's really close there. Look at all those marbles grouping together. Penguin now takes over second. Penguin jumps to the lead in front of Rainforest. And a larger lead now. Penguin trying to jump well in front. And if you can get some clean air before you go into that propelling system system, and then up on into the, uh, I guess, plexiglass uh, partition there, you can really gain some advantage on your lead there. Now Black Shadow's going to make a pass on Rainforest. Ivory and Volcano still occupying 11th and 12th. And it is Penguin and now Black Shadow. And the lead is over a second and a half. Penguin trying to continue that lead. They are one, two, three in a row as Rattlesnake battles with Pacifica and Black Shadow. It's Black Shadow in second. The lead still belongs to Penguin. And right now, Penguin has run the fastest lap, a 20.502, which was run on the second lap. We're now on lap five, and it's Rattlesnake who's taken the lead. Penguin had a lead of over a second and a half, and the last two marbles, you can see them coming there pretty well behind. But it's Rattlesnake in front of Penguin. Black Shadow and then Pacifica. And now Rattlesnake has run the fastest lap. In the lead right now. We said clean air could be important. Up and around they go. Oh, big contact there. I think that may have been Rock Slide. Lead is four tenths of a second right now. Rattlesnake back to Penguin. Canarium started on the pole, still running middle of the pack in seventh. Oh, look at the contact there between the two leaders, and it's going to be a pass again for Rattlesnake. We will take back over the lead. And now Pacifica makes a pass for third. Black Shadow drops to fourth. Rock Slide. First time we're calling their name up into fifth place. Remember, 19 laps in this competition. And now Pacifica making a pass for second. Rattlesnake still holding the lead, and the lead is eight tenths of a second reach that area where we have a scoring system set up and now look at the pass being made Pacifica takes the lead and might lead this lap right on their tail is Rattlesnake it's Pacifica across the line and now here comes Penguin again nice move and there will not be a lot of clean air that time Penguin now takes the lead Pacifica just ran the fastest lap however they have been passed back for the lead now they're gonna make a pass again they are three wide here Penguin and Pacifica and Rattlesnake all battling Meanwhile, Black Shadow going to try to make a move while that's happening. Ivory and Volcano still really, really struggling. Last week's winner, Angel, hanging in the back of the pack in ninth right now. Pacifica still leading. It's now four marbles going for the lead, and it is going to be Black Shadow and Penguin battling for the lead. Now the next two marbles, all the way back to sixth in Rainforest, trying to get in this matchup here. As we start to wind down on the laps, we're in lap number 11 of 19. Penguin trying to build a lead. They led by over a second and a half earlier in this race. Trying to continue that. Top six trying to pull away. Canarium has moved all the way up to third. Now it's really the top three and then the next three. Before you 
slide off there. Canarium just ran the fastest lap now. The pole sitter, nobody's run a faster time. 24.01. And look at that, we might get a lap marble. Volcano, really struggling. Well back. And that could get very interesting. Lead belongs to Rattlesnake. Rattlesnake will come across the line. Pretty close, but it's Penguin that takes that lap in second place. But now, Canarium retakes that lead. Canarium might have a chance at the lead. One, two, three in a row. Canarium now has the lead. Let's see if a move is made. It is going to be made by Penguin to take that lead back. And they are closing in on Volcano, who would become the first lapped marble in this race. And could cause some issues. And oh no! Volcano, just as we were mentioning it, off the course. Missed the plexiglass partition. And will finish in last, unable to get through the rest of this course. Really struggling anyway. And so now you don't have to worry about, at least for the moment, a lap marble. That's a break for the leaders, as they are all close here. Officially now a DNF for Volcano. Penguin is in the lead. Canarium, the pole sitter, trying to end that stigma that the pole sitter cannot win. Canarium and Penguin still battling. Pacifica has dropped back a little bit here. We'll have another look at our replay, and let's see what happened. Yep, too much speed, shockingly, for the marble that's in last. All the way down to the lower portion of the... Of course, good thing that there wasn't a marble down there, otherwise it could have been even more disaster rather than just for Volcano. Ivory had been hanging out in 11th, but they have now moved their way up to 8th. It's Dragon's Tail that's dropped all the way back. Angel struggling yet again, and Canarium still holding the lead. Pacifica trying to get back in this one. Pacifica actually now is closer to 2nd than 2nd is to 1st. Penguin starting to let this one slip away a little bit. Canarium, there's only a couple more laps left in this race, and if you don't hurry, Canaria might run away with it. And actually, just as I said that, here we go, Pacifica making a move. Gonna try to retake the lead. For the moment, it is still Canarium. And they come to the line, two laps to go. Canarium, Pacifica, Rattlesnake in third. Penguin and Rainforest are the top five. Pacifica takes the lead, jumps over where they hit the partition, makes a nice move. The top five are all in this thing. Nitro's in six, but not really a part of the competition in terms of qualifying or uh, competing for the win here. Final lap, here we go. Pacifica is the leader. Canarium battling. Here comes Rattlesnake. They come over the partition, and it's Canarium who takes the lead. Now here comes Rattlesnake into second, being pushed by Pacifica, drafting up against that yellow marble. It's two yellows and a blue. Canarium retakes it, and Canarium's going to take the win. And they come across the line very close. It's Rattlesnake that's going to get second. Third to Pacifica. Rainforest fourth. Penguin will take fifth. Nitro, Black Shadow, Rock Slide. Angel will end up ninth. Ivory is tenth. And finally, here comes 11th place Dragon's Tail, who almost got lapped on that final lap. Nearly didn't finish the course. And of course, Volcano had that scary incident earlier. And so... They are unable to finish and will take last place and be awarded the points that they get for that, which will be 25 points. You can see Rattlesnake was the biggest gainer. Gained seven spots all the way up to second, but Canarium proves the stigma wrong. A pole sitter can win. Does it with an overall time of 6 minutes and 46.1 seconds. And an impressive, definitely not leading for all the way, but they did a great job uh, to win from the pole. They'll move up to third, becoming... Uh, yet another winner in this competition. Rattlesnake is the points leader still. They are now up six points on Nitro. Canarium moves into third with a win here today and the pole. And we'll have a look at some of our highlights today. I mentioned how hard it's been for these pole sitters to get even into the first turn with the lead, and that was the case yet again. Although Canarium, as we know now, will come back to win the race, it was Rainforest who jumped out to the lead, and Canarium went from the lead all the way to seventh. Just out of that first turn, it was a really rough start. You can see there was a lot of contact between some of these marbles here. This was in lap four. 
and at this point in time, Penguin had gotten out to a pretty sizable lead. But there were some big runs, like that one right there. Rattlesnake had made a nice move. Some of the slow motion looks at that plexiglass. And you can tell the contact just looking at the course. Watch there, right there, when the marbles hit back down on the pavement. You can see some, some give there in the pavement, as there is certainly been a lot of contact and a hard impacts for these marbles. Obviously, we're hoping the best for Volcano after a significant accident, which we'll see later on in these highlights. But, uh... A lot of back and forth. Pacifica ran a nice race. Have a look at... Ah, I didn't even see that the first time through Dragon's Tail with a big mistake there. You can see... A lot of that, three, three by three going through that specific area of the course, one, two, three. Here's what we saw from Volcano up and over, and you see making contact right there, and then entirely off the course. Hopefully everything's okay there. Canary and Pacifica battling side by side going into the final lap, and this is where the move was made. Canarium stayed lower on the course, which is actually exactly what you wanted to do, because you see... Got that advantage coming out of that turn. And ultimately, that's what got the win for Canarium. Wins it by a little less than three tenths of a second. Rattlesnake will take second. And Pacifica, who took the white flag in the lead, will finish in third. Fastest lap was a 24.01. Ran on lap 11. By your winner, Canarium, who picked up a lot of points, got the pole. Got the fastest lap, and of course the win doesn't hurt either. An impressive day for Canarium, catapulting them back into uh, the, the championship talks, as it is a big day at Moonscape Circuit for Canarium and for a lot of these marbles. And then a